Okay guys, I have this old Mitsubishi CP9800 um, die sublimation printer from like Windows XP um, era and it's connected to my uh, new PC with Windows uh, it, Windows 10 and it won't install or Windows won't recognize so we're gonna figure out how to make this happen okay I'm gonna go here search printer and scanners press enter and we're gonna go add a new printer here and it's gonna do you know automatic searching for the old printer and it won't show so you're gonna go here where it says the printer that I want is enlisted so the first option is my printer is a little old or a little older help me find it so I'm gonna press next and it's gonna do all the searching and it will not find it no matter what no matter which port I put in or what I do so there's nothing I can do at this point so I'm just gonna exit out cancel and here's what you're gonna do uh, we're gonna restart the computer in the safe mode click on the restart while holding down the shift so I'm gonna hold down the shift button on the keyboard and I'm gonna click on the restart and restart anyway okay so this screen is gonna come up so I'm gonna go troubleshoot and I'm gonna go to advanced option I'm gonna go to startup setting and I'm gonna click on the restart so at this point what I want is number seven disable driver signature enforcement so I'm gonna press number seven on the keyboard okay so we want to go back to um, the printer so on the search I'm gonna type in printer okay now we're gonna do the add printer and it will look for it and the printer that I want is enlisted click on that so at this point um, I'm gonna click on add a local printer with the manual setting next and use an existing port so I connected the printer to the USB port so I'm gonna choose a virtual printer port for USB and next and I'm gonna go uh, click I'm gonna click on have a disk so I'm gonna browse okay so on my desktop I'm gonna go to a folder where I put the uh, printer driver and click on that open okay and now that printer driver um, menu came up so I'm gonna click on next and I'm gonna add and this message is gonna pop up so when you see this pop up you're gonna click on install this driver anyway Do not share this printer. I'm not gonna do that. Finish. So let's see where we have it. Okay, so here it is. It's installed. I'm gonna go to manage and make sure everything is there. So see, it's showing the menu. I'm gonna do a test print. Uh, landscape, okay, apply and print a test page okay here is the test page with today's date april 6. um you can do this for any uh old printers old printers from like windows xp era that won't um self-install so remember the key point here is to reboot into the safe mode um, and it was number seven on the keyboard that let you uh, install drivers without the the signature. Um, so yeah, yeah. So that's how you install old printers without Windows 10 or Windows 11 latest drivers. Thank you for watching, guys. Good luck.